Hi, this is Caleb Gedkin. Today I'll be giving you a list of six Bible verses about puzzles. Let's pray before we get started. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for your Holy Spirit being Lord of our lives and Savior of our lives. Please show us what you want us to learn and apply it to our lives. If it's from the Father, and I pray. Amen. Let's get started. Number one, the Lord is my shepherd. I have all that I need. He lets me rest in green meadows. He leads me beside peaceful streams. He renews my strength. He guides me along right paths, bringing honor to his name. Even when I walk through the darkest valley, I will not be afraid. For you are close beside me. Your rod and your staff protect and comfort me. You prepare a feast for me in the presence of my enemies. You honor me by anointing my head with oil. My cup overflows with blessings. Surely your goodness and unfailing love will pursue me all the days of my life, and I will live in the house of the Lord forever. Psalm 23, 1 through 6. Number 2. Those who live in the shelter of the Most High will find rest in the shadow of the Almighty. This I declare about the Lord. He alone is my refuge, my place of safety. He is my God, and I trust him. For he will rescue you from every trap and protect you from deadly disease. He will cover you with his feathers. He will shelter you with his wings. His faithful promises are your armor and protection. Do not be afraid of the terrors of the night, nor the arrow that flies in the day, nor the not do not dread the disease that stalks in darkness nor the d disaster that strikes at midday. Though a thousand fall at your side, though ten thousand are dying around you, those, these evils will not touch you. Just open your eyes and see how the wicked are punished. If you make the Lord your refuge, if you make the Most High sh your shelter, no evil will conquer you. No plague will come near your home, for he will order his angels to protect you wherever you go. They will hold you up with their hands, so you won't even hurt your foot on a stone. You will trample upon lions and cobras. You will crush fierce lions and serpents under your feet. The Lord says, I will rescue those who love me. I will protect those who trust in my name. When they call on me, I will answer. I will be with them in trouble. I will rescue and honor them. I will reward them with a long life and give them my salvation. Number three, God sits above the circle of the earth. The people below seem like grasshoppers to him. He spreads out the heavens like a curtain and makes his tent for them. Isaiah forty twenty two. Number four, we can rejoice too when we run into tr problems and trials. For we know that they help us and develop endurance. And endurance develops strength of character. And character strengthens our confident hope of salvation. Romans 5, 3, and 4. Number five, dear friends, you always followed my instructions when I was with you, and now that I am away, it is even more important. Work hard to show the results of your salvation, obeying God with deep reverence and fear. For God is working in you, giving you the desire and the power to do what pleases him. Do everything without complaining and arguing so that no one will can criticize you. Live clean, innocent lives as children of God, shining like bright lights in a world full of crooked and perverse people. Hold firmly to the word of life. Then on the day of Christ's return, I will be proud that I did not run the race in vain, and that my work was not useless. Philippians three twelve through 16 Number 6. Patient endurance is what you need now, so you will continue to do God's will. Then you will receive all that he has promised. Hebrews ten thirty six. I hope these Bible verses are helpful, and you enjoyed this video. Please let me know what you think, learned, or any questions you have in the comment section below. Please be polite and respectful. God loves you, and I love you too. Bye.